hi everyone it feels so weird to be vlogging i feel like my past few videos i have not vlogged in a bit so hello welcome back to my channel tomorrow is the first day of fall break i still technically have classes but i'm leaving right after my 11 o'clock class to go home so tonight i'm gonna be packing cleaning up my room a little bit i have one more homework assignment um to finish up um, and then I should be ready to go. So I thought I would vlog while I was at home. I'm definitely really excited to go home. I feel like I've just been in such a like mental slump these past two weeks. So I think going home is just like really, really gonna help me out. I also finished a book today. I finished the audiobook of Misery by Stephen King. This book was an emotional roller coaster. I tried it out because I thought it wouldn't be as gory as like his other horror books. I was definitely wrong. Um, it was pretty gory for me because I don't really like gore. Um, so it was pretty gory for me, but I still liked it. I gave it a 3.5 because I did think it got a little bit wordy, a little bit too wordy for my liking. Um, but I loved the plot and I loved the intensity and just Stephen King's mind is just so cool. Um, so I gave it a 3.5 and then I'm starting Actar next, the third Actar book. Good morning, everyone. What do you think my major is? Just like, take a quick little guess. Yes, I am wearing my Fed merch. I also have my Fed shirt on under this, but I wanted to wear it today. It's just really comfy and I'm gonna be driving all day. So I had this whole plan where I was gonna get up early, load up my car and like have some time to like tidy up my room, grab last few last minute things but then that just didn't happen so now I'm rushing I have like an hour until my class starts and I still have to load up my car grab my breakfast so we were running a little bit late this morning but you know what it's okay it's fine um, I only have two classes today. I have learning and assessment at 10 a.m. And then I have digital marketing at 11. And then from there, I'm going to leave and go get gas um, and then go home. So I'm predicting that I should be home sometime around 3, 3.30. Um, yeah, that's that's the plan. <laughs> hey, everybody. So um, crazy day today. Literally insane day. Um, so I went and I got my new phone and I'm obsessed with it. I absolutely love it. It's amazing. That was the one thing that I wanted for my birthday this year was a new phone. So we went and did that and then we came home, chilled for a little bit. And then we had my grandparents over for an early birthday celebration because I won't be here for my actual birthday. So today was sort of the day that we celebrated it. It was my 21st. So I had my first drink. It's not sitting very well in my stomach, but I don't know if that's like a normal thing but my mom bought me some alcohol to bring back and she also got me just a few like little gag gifts because like obviously the phone was the big thing but she did get me two books that i've been wanting she got me hellbent which is the sequel to ninth house which i'm super duper excited to read and then she got me the wedding people everyone and their mother has been talking about this book and i really want to read it so i put it on my list good morning it is 9 a.m. I'm leaving for church in about two and a half hours and I'm frantically trying to get my marketing communications homework done. So I started it on Friday and then I realized, wow, this is a lot of work. So I need to kind of spread it out. Um, and then yesterday I literally did not do any work on it. So I decided that I would get up early today. I got up at 8.30, so I've already been working on this for about half an hour. Basically, what I have to do is I have to create a content calendar for the business that I'm doing. Okay, so I'm basically rebranding a business. That's my product project. So I chose Books A Million, and I had to create a content calendar for this week and then create a Facebook post and an Instagram post for each day this week. Um, so it's like 14 different posts in addition to the calendar and then I have to also create two ads and then a wireframe for revamping their website so it's a lot um so I'm hoping to finish up the posts quickly because I have I have I made the calendar on Friday so I know everything that I'm making posts for I just haven't made them yet so I'm working on that um and then I'm heading to church 
Hi friends! So I am now starting my reread of Business or Pleasure. I'm super excited. I feel like it's been a bit since I've touched a romance novel, so I'm very very excited to pick this up and read it. And obviously I love Rachel Lynn's Women. I'm using a bookmark that I got at the fall market. There was a bookish stand that we went to that was really cute. That was selling cute bookmarks. So I got this one and I also got another one. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited to dive into this and I'm actually going to be annotating it. I really want all of my Rachel Lynn books to end up being annotated because she's my favorite romance author. So. I'm heading back so obviously my room got really messy so I have a haircut at 11 15 so my goal is to go to my haircut and I'm probably going to be home at around noon I'm going to eat lunch clean up my room and pack up my stuff and hopefully hit the road by 1 1 30 that's my goal because then I'll be home around 3 34 um I feel like that's just ideally the best time um, and then when I do get home, I'm thinking I'm probably going to go grocery shopping because I have a literally no food at my house and then take a shower and just chill for the rest of the night. Um, I'm not going to like try to do homework or anything. I might do like one assignment, but so far since this week is only a three day week, it's a pretty light homework week. So I think I should be okay. And then this weekend I'm starting the move out process did I mention this? I don't know if I already talked about this, but basically our apartment complex is getting renovated. And so on our first official move-in day, they were like, anytime within the next six months, you're going to get an email and you have three weeks to move out of your apartment and move into the newly renovated ones. And we got our email a couple of days ago, I think. And so we have until October 18th to move out. And so I kind of wanted to do a gradual move out. And so Saturday I'm going to do um a decent amount of my clothes and leave just like a week's worth of clothes there so like moving out all of my clothes maybe start doing kind of like the bigger stuff like my reading chair and stuff like that and then that Thursday night I do have a said club meeting but I was thinking of maybe that evening doing some stuff as well, like doing some stuff from the kitchen and the living room. And then that Friday, which would be the 17th, doing everything else. So like my bookshelf, um, everything from the kitchen, everything from the living room. And then the 18th, if I have anything remaining, doing all of that, like my, the art from my walls, things like that. So I'm hoping since if I do it gradually, it won't be as bad. So I'm hoping to start that, not this weekend, but next weekend. No, next weekend. Yes. <laughs> okay, I'm wearing this new sweater that I got from the fall market. I think it's cute. It's very comfy. I'm actually about to head into the store that's like right next to my hair salon because they only take cash tips. So I think I'm going to go in and buy like chapstick or something and get cash back because I don't have any cash on me. And I want to be able to tip my service workers so we're gonna head in and do that because i'm really early i'm like 30 minutes early so i'm gonna kill some time by going and getting some cash for the tip ah uh, okay first of all this is my haircut i think it looks so good secondly i'm officially home um i am super duper glad that i cleaned up my room in my bathroom before i left because coming back to a clean room was just like so satisfying and just what I needed and like the perfect reset to get me into the headspace for school tomorrow so I have school and work tomorrow um I just got groceries so I should be set for the week um yeah the upcoming week I should have plenty of food um it should last me a decent amount of time um 
yeah, I, I think I'm gonna vlog a little bit still throughout the week, but I'm not sure yet. We'll see. Good morning, everyone. It is 8.30 a.m. I got up early because last night I realized I left my brush at home. So I just ran to Walgreens and picked up a new brush. It's honestly good because I feel like I've been needing a new one because my other one is like really old. It's like three years old. So I picked up this one and it comes with a little mini one. I hope this works. Um, yeah. So now I'm going to go to school. <laughs> okay, little update. I officially finished my reread of Business or Pleasure. This was a five out of five stars. Are we surprised? I literally cried, I think three times. And like I said earlier, this hit so much harder the second read through, like I loved it. I also loved the SNL movie. We went to go see that movie today. It was very good. It was so stressful as someone who works in the entertainment industry and has had experience directing and running a show watching it all like like the timer and like how they're crunched for time and like everything was going wrong it was so stressful for me to watch but i think like that was the point of the movie and that's why it was good so i really enjoyed it um and then i mailed my mail-in ballot and then we got ryan's car washed we came back here, I got some dinner, and then we watched You. We've been watching You because it's Ryan's favorite show. And I told her I'd watch it with her for spooky season. So we watched a couple episodes of You, and then I finished up my book. So pretty good day, all in all. Hey guys, so I'm gonna end this video. It's getting really long, so we're just gonna stop for right now. Make sure you subscribe, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and check out my social medias in the description box below for more content from me and i will see you guys in the next video bye